Alrighty, so we got started. <laughs> I flooded it. Sorry about that. Alrighty. Alrighty, so let's go through it. Checklist again. Two centimeters. Right, so let's get our radios on. We want 121.9, 125.1. Zero kilometers. Cloud scattered 4,500. Temperature 28. QNH 1007. First contact with Camden Tower or ground. Not a forest information. Charlie. 1007. Charlie. Camden Tower information. Charlie. Runway 24. 24. Operations in progress. Wind 270 degrees 1 2 knots. Crossing maximum 1 0 knots. 270 1 2 knots. Cloud scattered 4,500. Temperature 28. QNH 1007. First contact with Camden Tower or ground. Information, Charlie. Charlie, okay. There it is, it's Charlie. Oh, Charlie. Okay. I'll put it back on ground, we'll just call them up. Camden Ground, Cessna, Julia, Bravo, Charlie, Scout Hangar for the training area. Received Charlie, request taxi clearance. Bravo, Charlie, taxi, holding point on my 2-4, the time is 2-1. Holding point 2-4, Juliet, Bravo, Charlie. Alrighty, let's make our way to the uh, holding point. Find my water. Bottle of water. Okay, everybody's happy. QNH is set. We've got positive amps going in, which makes sense because I've just cranked it a lot. We've got uh, greens there, we've got plenty of fuel. Alrighty, let's make our way to the training area. On my 2 4 it is. Checking that everything's okay. My wings. My window's still open. Uh, 220 off, complete. Back to the hangar, shut down. And we're just looking for wind. Uh, like that. Take uh, 220 now, Richard. Drop my little thing, that's okay. And tower, I've got to drop the fires ready. Uh, 28 for a upward departure. 24, we're going to go on. Telling off for power, runway 28 liner. Uh, that should be Telling off my legs. I've been flying for a couple of weeks, so I'm a little bit rusty. That's cool. This is Glider Tug Foxtrot Bravo India with Glider November Kilo Charlie for 3000 ready to for Glider receive Charlie. Now we're going to go to the training area. Foxtrot Bravo India Glider 24 cleared for takeoff. And I can see Glider wind sort of down the runway ish. Bravo, about 27, so we can see. Don't worry, Julia Fazulu, empty on the oak, 3300 receive Charlie. Fazulu, Cannon Tower, joint downward runway 24. I'm just going to turn around here. Two, I'm downwind runway 24, maintain 1800 and report 2 miles. Julia Fazulu. And Dennis, you got room for a couple of seconds for Julia Fazulu? I should fit it in for you, mate. Legend. Into the wind. Got a golf for power, runway 28, cleared for takeoff to part on climb if you wish. Lift yeah. the and we'll so. be departing on climb. Uh, Turn this down a little bit. Just turn that down. Right, oh, so we're going to do our pre takeoff checks now. Fuel both and sufficient, plenty of fuel. There's an RPM, we've got flaps check and set. Autopilot. Uh, Victor, what that was, yes, definitely showing on this. And, uh, yeah, let's put our bug 
one, two, four. Put on west and just see what happens. Continue tracking by the Arnav approach. There is traffic uh, about three miles ahead of you inbound from the Oaks for uh, downwind of Cherokee. Copy, traffic. Auto pilot we went on, we're going to check for heading and we've got it set. Yes, yep, uh, override. Beautiful. Autopilot. Yep, we got you. Put it on 2 4 now. Okay, so extra fully rich. Okay, 18. we got temperatures good. 1800 RPM. Okay. Left. Check right. Charlie, Julie, Victor, Check idle. Two, four, clean for takeoff. Take That's off, all Charlie, good. Victor. All good. Mixture lean. Trials check. Yep. Controls check. Good. Julie, that's all right. Locked. Now, what about the really clear visual approach, 2 4 number 1? Yes. Clear visual approach, number 1. So what we're going to do, we're going to take off in uh, 2 4. We're going to make a right turn and go 3 3 0. If we have a emergency on the ground, we're going to close the throttle. Oscar, confirm uh, visual. Brakes is required and vacate the aircraft. We have an emergency and we're still on the runway but airborne. Throttle. To just uh, take off throttle, flaps is required, brakes is required, and vacate the aircraft. We have an engine failure on climb out. We're going to lower the nose, uh, 65 knots, plus or minus 30 degrees heading. Looking for a place to land. In our case, it'll be on our right. Okay, enjoy the flight. Alrighty, trim. Right, let's go. Just looking for traffic. Taxi. Cherokee turning crosswind to load 11 o'clock, one more. Victor, Alaska, we're looking and we're breaking off the approach now for down. Victor, uh, Alaska, number two for the runway following a Cherokee to late down. Looking at Victor, Alaska, number two. And we've got wind uh, on our right, so the uh, uh, ailerons in. That's okay, 2 4, to let us loose. on the field. I oh, know. They're behind the fence. <laughs> I've come to have a look. Okay, we're looking pretty good. And yeah, we'll just taxi on down here. Just stop here looking for traffic. There's some traffic there. Come Alright, change on the tower frequency, mixture, DI is set, so let's just check out DI, oops, uh, DI is north, grave is on, and transponder set to out. Camden Tower, Cessna, Juliet, Bravo, Charlie, ready, runway 24 for crosswind departure. Got Bravo, Charlie, defy crosswind, cleared for takeoff, runway 24. Clear for takeoff, Juliet, Bravo, Charlie. Here we go. Okay, line up on the runway. Throttle in, 
And we're just lining up the uh, runway with our feet. Airspeed's alive. Take that down. 60 knots. A little bit of a crosswind there. Okay, a bit of aileron in. 80 knots. Clear touch and go. That's a good thing, don't I? 80 knots. Over a shoulder. Lost, that's metric approach. A little bit bumpy. Balance the ball. Five hundred feet AGL, we're gonna make a right turn. Okay, right, so center and left. Yeah, it's taking the right turn. 330. Zulu number 2, follow the Baron on final. Number 2, traffic inside, Zulu. 330. We're going to stay at 1300 feet. And squaring that off. Beautiful. Trim for 80 knots. Coming up to 1200. Balance the ball. 330. Just get it up to 1300. Over the river. Okay, 1300 feet. Bottle back. Trim for that. 2400 RPM. Trim. Okay, well, we did that. We're about two miles away, so we're going to go VFR, which is 1200. We got about 100 knots ASB. Now we're going to go up to, we'll go up to two and a half thousand, eh? That'll do us. 2500 today. 80 knots. Balance the ball. Still going 330, a bit bumpy. Okay, welcome to the uh, Western welcome Sydney training area. Training <laughs> Hope you enjoy it. Foxtrot, Bravo India. And I'm just looking for traffic. So this is one of the Scouts uh, New South Wales Air Activity Centres Cessna 172s. Clear touching, yeah. The 172 S yeah. model, so it's a little bit more powerful than the R models. Uh, got an increased uh, RPM range, which gives us a couple, or well, a few more horsepower. My name's Steve, I'm an RPL pilot, so I have a recreational pilot's licence. I'm currently training towards my private pilot's licence. So what I'm doing today is getting some uh, solo time. Just some me time out of the training area. What a lovely day it is too. A little bit of cloud around. A few bumps, but uh, nothing to worry about. We're going to go 330 until we get over to the um, yeah, Blue Mountains area. We'll turn right and we'll just do a few, few turns and a bit of a play up this way. I'm uh, coming up on my cruise altitude which is two and a half thousand feet which is perfectly fine. I need to be a thousand feet below clouds. It's pretty well what I'm at. Two and a half thousand so I'm going to throttle back now just to a nice Cruise altitude, nose down, hold that attitude, woo. <laughs> and just trim for that. Good. Just trim, beautiful. Now if it's in trim, the Cessna, it fly itself. Okay, it's pretty well right. You just gotta watch the. And uh, can Julian have to do a request to low level circuit so up to 28 for a touching? What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna Hello. put this on 124.55 and I'm gonna also listen. Uh, 124.55. Uh, which is the banks to uh, the uh, Sydney Centre. Fox Okay, I'm a little bit higher than I want to be, so I'm just going to bring it down a bit to where I should be. And I'm just looking out for traffic. A little bit of a headwind today. A little bit. Not too bad. And over on our left over there is Warragamba. I think of Warragamba Dam and so on. I'm climbing and I don't want to climb. Got that climb. Okay, 
get back to where we should be. Uh, trim for that altitude and that is Oh, new bumps. I'm just going to keep it here at 2,700. Charlie, Foxtrot, India, Sydney Centre. Trim for that, mate. Sydney Terminal, Charlie Fox at India, three miles north of Long Reef at 1,500, requesting airways clearance for Harbour Scenic. And a few guys doing Harbour Scenic, which is nice. Clear controlled airspace, full advice. Main clear controlled airspace, uh, Charlie Fox at India. I'm just going past where I am now. Sydney Centre, good day, rescue. Our left there. Medi back, main turning 5,000. And I'm just going to trim that to get the right. Traffic currently, your 12 o'clock, six miles left to right, 5,100 on descent. It's uh, Lima, 6th of November, a Cessna 208, 208 inbound to Wollongong. Okay, so we're just following Coming the Canadian River on our left. There's the dam there, as you can see. Beautiful. I've just got to watch I don't go outside the training area. There'll be a pipeline, which I'm looking for, which is coming up now. I'm going to make a right turn so I don't go across that pipeline, because that's our training area. Uh, 3, 2,800, I'm just uh, trim for that altitude, and attitude looks good. I'm going to check my um, DI, make sure it hasn't processed. Yeah, it's pretty well right. Pretty well between north and 330, which is about right. Vertical speed is good, so we're holding altitude. 4,577. 4,500. We're on uh, Sydney Centre frequency. And I'm just going to do a right turn in a little while. Sure, oh, we're going down. Try and keep that altitude. We've got it on full reach because we're in the training area, so I'm not overly worried about leaning it off. We're not on a nav. And it's a beautiful day. And we're looking for traffic, so we're going to go check left, check centre, check right. 30 degree turn. bit of rudder and we're just looking for traffic we're just going to follow the training area and we're climbing so we don't want to climb trim and lane of entry traffic for attack 253 entry Brooklyn Bridge 1500 nice turn too drastic and we'll just follow this uh, pipeline for a while checking all our gauges are all looking good all green Sydney Centre identified standby okay attitude two thousand seven hundred is what we want hands off flies beautifully as you can see it's usually the pilot that causes the problem going zero six zero which is uh, you know Sort of northeast -ish. Straight ahead, we've got Prospect Reservoir. And um, that's one of the inbound reporting points for Bankstown. And on the throttle, there's a strip down there called Kennett Strip, where we can do some uh, practice forced landings and precautionary search on landings. Okay, I'm climbing. Bugger up. 26 contact departures. I'm going to level up at 3,000. Departures 1297, rescue 26. Bit of a headwind there, as you can tell. And I'm straight ahead. I've got uh, 12 o'clock, so I'm going to take evasive action. Right turn. I'm uh, going to go under him. Directly under him. He's good. And he's just having a bit of a play out there. Charlie Fox, India, identified, verify level. I have to make a right turn. Um, 1,500, Charlie Fox for India. Away from that guy. Charlie Fox India, contact departures 123.0. Contact departures 123.0, Charlie Fox for India. And he's coming back my way. I'm going to get right out his way. Doing some really weird stuff. And whoa. Victor, expect climb in the box, contact approach 128.0. Let's just get out of his way, right? Yeah, 28, Sydney Centre. Good day, we're just overhead, 1,400 received uniform. Requesting a clearance to operate about uh, 300 metres north of the present position, just over towards the port, hacking out about the 1,000. And over on the left there's Brinjelli. Media, 
Yeah, 28. Request not available due to 3-4 left operations. Understood. Made it 28. I'm going to keep it 2,500 now, so a little bit more throttle. Trim for that. Holding on to helicopter care, 5-4. Early on the left. Camden's right ahead on our, uh, about hours 11 o'clock, 12, uh, 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock. Care, flight 4, Sydney Centre. Yes, helicopter care, flight 4 is Scarborough passing at 1,800 on climb 2,500. We're air work medevac for uh, St George Hospital. Request airways clearance 2,500. Now we've got a chopper on the way through from uh, Scarborough. Way to St George. No, just keeping my orientation. I know roughly I'm going, uh, you know, sort of southwest. See the airfield from here, so there's no need to. Uh... Okay, it's looking good. Over Warra Gamba now. Three and a half thousand. We want. We're going to do a left turn. Check left, right, centre, and left. Left turn. Want to do south? Thank you, Charlie. I understood. I will advise you to make clear across, Charlie. There we go, due south. Watching our altitude. I can see Camden at about 11 o'clock. Not too well at the moment, Simo. A bit of height. Tango Charlie Echo, Squawk 0321. Squawk 0321, Tango Charlie Echo. Media 28, go ahead, the amended sights on. Please amend our sight time just expired to uh, time 0200 for Rodwell Channel 9, Media 28. Media 28, understood, the amended sights on now for Rodwell Channel 9, 0200. We want to have a listen to Camden now. 120.1. And we're going to listen to Adis. Sydney Centre, Fox Shot, Yankee, Charlie. Departed Wilson, pass of 4002. Crossing maximum 10 knots, visibility greater than 10 kilometres. Cloud scattered 4500. Temperature 28, QNH 1007. First contact with Camden Tower or ground. Not a forest in Charlie. Charlie. Hasn't changed. Okay. They are on 120.1. Information, Charlie. And just watching our altitude. And we've got 12 o'clock. Uh, Mayfield's just down there, which is a reporting point. Want to keep away from that if we can. We'll come in by uh, Brangeli, which is just over here on our left. I've got him in sight. Nine o'clock low. And we're just looking for traffic. Let's just get out of this place because we're a little bit busy here, right, centre and left. Thirty degree turn. Watching our altitude. Follow that guy. Go back out north and then I'll come in via Brinjelly. And we're looking for traffic. And I've got something there on my left, which I don't know what is. Be me. That might have just been a building. Okay, altitude's good, airspeed's good, everything's in the green. Make one final pass out north, and then we're going to come in via Brinjelli. Jelly. 
Let's think about things we need to do when we land. We need to check ADIS, which we've done. Um, we've got Fox, we've got Charlie. He'll give us a clearance for a runway. And I've got a plane here on my nose. He's low. And uh, put Nathan our landing Charlie, lights on when we're two miles. Brakes undercarriage, mixed to fuel, instrument seats, harnesses, autopilot, etc. Remember in circuit, height, height, steer and strut. Remember, runway two four, cleared for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, runway two four. See you, Charlie. November. Two, three, one, two, and three. All low. Good afternoon, good afternoon. Glad a golf Oscar Bravo, ready. Oscar golf Bravo, I think it was. They might actually really be cool. birds. <laughs> Birds, I think. The plane directly ahead of them. And we've climbed 200 feet. See what happens when you don't watch the altitude. <laughs> We're going to go out to the pipeline and turn back in. That'll be our day. That'll be our one hour. Alright, I think I'm going to turn now. I'm going to follow this guy to see what he's doing. I really want to get near him. Check the ADIS again. 28, QNH1007. First contact with Camden Tower or Ground. Night of Forest Information, Charlie. Charlie. Camden Tower Information, Charlie. Runway 24. In progress, two, two seven zero degrees one two knots, crossing maximum one zero. Two seven zero one two knots. Okay, so it's right down the runway. We have a headwind coming in. Okay, I'm going to just make a right turn, right, turn it and left. Okay, way back now. Charlie November, downwind, touch and go. There's from Jelly just there. Think about what we're going to do. Charlie November, 24 clear, touch and go. Let's get down to 2000 over Brin Jelly. Clear, touch and go, runway 24, Sierra Charlie November. And Camden's directly ahead there, or on park, which means that's Brin Jelly. We're just going to look at the traffic. Once I'm over Brin Jelly, I'll be calling up to the tower. Taking a bit of power off, so I need to do a bit of rudder, opposite rudder. <laughs> Believe it or not. Let's just trim for that descent. We don't want it too steep. About 500 feet a minute's good. Which is nice. Just let it descend. And I'm just looking for. Traffic Jelly will call the tower up. Just watching our speed. And we'll call them now. Camden T 
Tower, Cessna, Julia Bravo, Charlie, Brinjelli, 2200, proceed, Charlie inbound. Julia Bravo, Charlie, join final on my 24, 1800, reported to uh, Oran Park. Join final 24, maintain 1800, report Oran Park, Julia Bravo, Charlie. So you want 1800. You want to join final for 24. Let's get down to 1,800. Here's your 1,800. Maintain that. The landing lights in when we're over Oran Park. One thousand eight hundred we want. Park, which is just here. Be the runway.
All right, so we're just going to get 65 knots now, a little bit fast. Get our flaps out. And this guy's just landed. And I see it's a bit of a crosswind. He's gone off the centre line, so we'll just uh, watch our speed. We want 65 knots. He's good. He's good, a little bit low. Speed happening. Keep it on the centre line. A little bit of a crosswind. A crosswind is into the wind. One wheel on the ground. Juliet Bravo Charlie, clear to land. Clear to land, Juliet Bravo Charlie. One wheel into the wind. Other wheel down and then full aileron into the wind. Sport formation number two now. The Cessna following now on a half marathon. 80 knots, so too fast. Number two, sport formation. 30 degrees. 100 RPM, too fast. 70 good knots. Afternoon, good afternoon, Golf Lima Par radio check. Golf Lima Par, afternoon, Travis. Golf Lima Par. So 30 degrees flaps, it's a bit of a steeper approach. Romeo, it gives you a little eight, bit more space to, just to use your throttle. I want to try and get it right on the numbers, and I want to try and get it on the centre line. 65 knots. Nearly on the centre line. 65 knots. So uh, we'll just keep right down. Right on the centre line. There we go. That was a bit of a bouncy one. <laughs> Never mind. I've done worse. And we're going to vacate the runway. And that's, uh, that's the landing. It wasn't much good, but we did it. <laughs> Let's just get off this runway. And we'll open the window for the air conditioning. Okay, flaps, mixture. Julia Bravo Charlie, taxi to parking. Taxi to parking, Julia Bravo Charlie, good day. Charlie, Julia Victor's overhead, 1,800. Charlie, Julia Victor, turn to the left, maintain 1,800, just about 30 degrees to the left, and uh, report sighting a Cessna mid-down with 12 o'clock. I'm excited, Charlie, Julia Victor. Well, I hope you enjoy that. That was a, uh, about a one hour flight, there you go, 59. <laughs> Roger, when ready, cleared visual approach and number three, follow that Cessna. So these um, choppers it's are getting ready for the, the fire season, Charlie, which is well, I got you pretty well started. The right on the <laughs> down, uh, they're all been assembled recently. Clear the option. Clear the option, small formation. And a bit of the aileron, because we've got a bit of a crosswind. Number two. And we'll just taxi Sarah along. Charlie. We've got plenty of fuel. We're not going to refuel fuel because we don't want to have full tanks carrying scouts. So I'll leave it about. I've only used about a quarter of a tank. I'm here on Whiskey 28. Clear to land. Backtrack approved. Clear to land to eight. Then backtrack. I'm here Whiskey 28. So taxiing should be about walking pace. So pretty well there. Going around. Oh, they're going around. Uh, we'll just go up here, park her on the grass. Sarah Charlie, number two, four, clear, touch and go. Clear, touch and go, Sarah Charlie, November. Right, so a couple of things we need to check now have landed. Ags left. Right. Yeah, pretty good. Uh, avionics off. See you later.